Hi everyone. In this video, we will learn about three important terminologies, and those are ramp up time, ramp down time, and steady state. And we will understand these three items with an example. So suppose in your project you have a requirement that you want to test the application performance for 100 concurrent users and you have to run the performance test for one hour. So what will you do? So suppose you have your performance test script already designed in some load test tool like Jmeter. So will you start applying all 100 users load all at once? Well you can certainly do that but that is not the right practice. What we have to do is we have to gradually increase the load to the system because if we apply all the 100 users on the application at once the application may crash so what we have to do is we have to do something like this uh, we have to start at the zero then increase the load to 10 users then 20 users then 30 users and then we have to reach 200 users gradually in some time let's say 10 minutes time and then keep the 100 users load constant for some duration so we have uh, 60 uh, minutes duration so we have to keep that 100 users uh, test running for let's say 60 minutes and then we have to gradually uh, decrease the number of users okay uh, so this this uh, gradual increase of users is called a ramp up time a time during which load is gradually increased on the application and this is done to prepare the application for load test okay so that your application can be prepared uh, so instead of crashing your application can gradually uh, start preparing for the performance test and once it reaches 400 users load then your load test can continue without uh, any errors uh, unwanted errors i would say and uh, similar to ramp up time ramp down time is the time during which the load is gradually decreased from the application so in this chart our uh, ramp up time is you know 10 minutes so in 10 minutes all the 100 users are gradually increased and then from that point on the 100 users load is constantly applied to the system okay so this is the ramp up time and this is the ramp down time and uh, ramp up time type uh, like ramp up time can be of two types one is uh, like, like we have just seen uh, we linearly apply that uh, load uh, to the application and another one is to uh, call is the uh, step up con configuration so we uh, apply like five users first then run it for some duration then we again uh, apply some more five users load on the application then run it for some duration and so on till we reach uh, some point where we want to do the uh, constant uh, load on the application okay so this are, these are the two types of uh, ramp up periods in performance testing and once we reach let's say 100 users load we steadily uh, keep the load on the application and this period is called the steady state okay so from uh, 10 minutes onward to 70 minutes this is called the steady state because we are steadily keeping the load on the application and uh, steady state is a point in time from when load will be steady for the application and uh, while we are uh, taking results for a performance test we should consider the results of for only the steady state and not for the ramp up and ramp down 